Hey guys, Front of the Night here, bringing you a brand new series called Night Hardcore, The End of Dragons. This is a brand new series where I'm doing something totally new. I'm going to do Hardcore Survival. I've never done Hardcore Survival ever in my Minecraft career. I've not, well, not career. I don't know what you call it, because it's not a career, but I don't want to call it Minecraft Life, because that's not accurate either. Mm. Ever in Minecraft, how about that? I've never done hardcore, one life only, ever in Minecraft. And the make... Uh, I've not actually done hard mode in Minecraft. So this is totally new to me, and I've got to... I've got to... I'm trying to be quick with some of these things as fast as possible, because... Guess what? I've only got one life in this. I've only got one shot um, to get things right. In this series, the, uh, the ultimate goal is to beat the Ender Dragon. And also, due to the fact, since I only got one life, I'm not even going to risk jumping into water. Well. Down here is a straight shot, but let's just get lower to make sure and... Whoop. Okay. Because I don't know when I might die, and I'm not... I mean, I'm not planning to die, but there is no guarantee I'm going to survive that I'm going to make them... That I'm going to record every single moment on this server. The server is going to be divided... The episodes are going to be divided into days. Each day is going to be one episode. Each... And each season... Uh, well, each... Holy crap, that's a witch's hut. Nope. I've never seen a witch's hut before. Okay, that's a lie. I've seen it in first Minecraft adventure, but... That's the second witch's hut I've ever come across, and that's the second time I've ever seen it that... I, I, we're in hardcore, so I can't even risk encountering a witch. Gosh, there's so much sheep here. And here, I was worried that I might not be able to make a bed... Um, the first night. Alright, what was I going on? Okay, basically each episode's going to be one day because I need to record every single thing and every single moment and I'm not going to edit anything out. And, but of course that means like stuff like laboring. Well, if I need to mine some materials, um, it's going to bore you guys. So each episode's going to be 10 minutes long. Uh, possibly longer because of the fact that I, I was, uh, if I didn't have a bed and I couldn't be at base or something. Because then I'll record into the night as well. But as soon as the next morning starts, it's the end of that episode. So, how are you guys doing? We're playing hardcore. We're gonna die. Oh, that reminds me. If I if I die and I don't complete killing the dragon, it ends that season. I reload a new map and we try again and again and again until we finally have a season where we beat the dragon. And then we might do then we might do a new playlist with um me trying to beat the wither at a later date. Not right away, of course. But yeah, so we're going to do... So yeah, well, welcome to Night Hardcore Survival. The End of Dragons. Where we're going to face the end dragon at the very end. We're going to get our butts whooped. But we are going to try anyway. And uh, this is hardcore mode, so it's like on hard mo mode. So I don't know how these, mods are, these mobs are going to hit like trucks. I don't know how hard it's gonna hit, they're gonna hit me, but I need to like not bother encountering them, and I need to make sure I don't even get close to a creeper. Cause, um, I watched this um ser series called um Trinity or something like that. I don't know. Check Captain Sparkle's channel or um Syndicates or oh my oh my God, it's Firefox or those people. And they're doing like a hardcore thing where they're on an island and their goal is to beat like three different types of bosses. But regardless, a creeper snuck up on um, Jiracho and, well, let's say it didn't end well for him. So he's off the series at episode three. Whoa! But now I'm scared because I don't know what I'm getting into. I have no idea how long I'm going to survive. So I don't think I can do stuff like make a, like a house that is so intricate and advanced 
I think what we need to do is like dig a hole into a mountain and call it our home. We need to be a hobbit, guys. We need to be a hobbit. We need to dig into somewhere and call it our house. So why don't I just go ahead and do that? Here, Here's a small little cave system to get us started anyway. So let's just gather up some stone and start building like a little house system. Um, we can make it prettier at a later date, but we don't need it pretty right now. We just need it to keep us safe. And at least until night, at least to protect us from mobs if for whatever reason we can't sleep at night. I would suck if I can't sleep at night. So let's just take all this stuff out. I'm sorry if it's boring you guys, but like I said, I can't predict each moment. And since I only have one life, I'm just going to have to record whatever I've got. So hopefully you guys don't get too bored of what's going on in the series. Um, I'll, I'll try to keep the commentary as much as possible, but like I said, each episode is going to be one Minecraft day, and, it, and sorry, I had to scratch my nose. Each Minecraft day is about 10 minutes. Um, night's also 10 minutes as well, so one full cycle is 20 minutes. But we're not, and we'll record one full cycle, but with bedtime. But when we go to bed, um, it'll shorten the episodes to. Um, to, um, two minutes so let's just bake up and make some charcoal so we can actually cook stuff and we can collect the charcoal that's over char char the collect the coal that's already here as well just trying to get some stuff to get started I might have to go over to that witch's hut though um not for anything important but like if I want to if I want to start like brewing potions and whatnot um like I don't know does a witch does a witch's hut come with um, potion stands or a brewing stand, my bad. Because I know they have cauldrons, but do they come included with brewing stands? Hmm. I don't know. Please tell me in the comments down below if you think, if you know that, if the, whether or not they come with brewing stands or not. Because that would be much helpful if it, I need to know if it would even be worth the trip. Um, I could look it up, of course, but I think it would be much more fun for everyone if I just find out the hard way. And here's some surface iron, which is pretty, which is pretty sweet. I'll have to remember it. I don't have a pick on me to gather it right now. Um, why don't I go ahead and chop up some more wood? Preferably, I should probably chop up all the wood near my house so the mobs don't have anything to hide under from the to hide from the sun. Because if they're hiding from the sun, then well, then I'm in trouble. Because then they're hiding from the sun, and then I can't get out of my house until they go away. Because I'm not armored up and whatnot. So why don't I go ahead and get everything situated near the um near my little thing. So we just need to get this rid of all these trees. Just like that. And I got I'm sorry guys, I just got quiet all of a sudden. I'm getting quiet. I'm doing a poor job at commentary. No! I don't really know how good at commentary I'm doing right now, but what the crap is going on over there? Oh, oh, wait, I think I saw a lava stream, so maybe, maybe there's lava? Oh, crap. There better not be a huge forest fire. Let's go take a look at the damage. Yeah, there's lava right here, and it's, and it looks like it's causing problems over there. So... As long as the fire stays over there, I'm we're good. We don't. I just don't want the fire to come over here. So let's just continue mining out some trees, because you can never have enough wood. Actually, that's not true. You can have so much wood, maybe too much wood. What you don't need, what you can never have enough of, is coal. That's a resource that you can never have enough of. So I guess wood can count. And here's a cow. I don't have a pen to trap them in, so we're just gonna kill them. Hi, cow. Bye, cow. All right. And we can pretty up this place later, but right now we just need to cover everything up so mobs can't come in. So that that is sealed up, and we can take some sticks. Make some torches. To 
light up in here. And it's getting dark, so let's just light up this area out here and then close everything off. And we're going to make some doors. Boom. So let's try something like this. I ran it. Okay, um. Wood planks time. Let's throw a door right here. And a door right here. So, like, I don't know. <laughs> For some extra protection somehow? I don't know. I'm just thinking if somehow, like, a mob destroys this door, it would give me, a, like, zombies. I know zombies can destroy doors. So it'll give me, like, a little warning and something, and I can, like, prepare for the zombie or whatnot. But, um, let's actually make a bed. I should have done that sooner. And let's sleep off the night. So this is officially the end of episode one of, um, of Hardcore Survival. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Good night.